Hey, Jenny. Hey, you guys. How are you guys? I'm doing good. I'm doing good, Jeannie. I'm doing good. All right, you guys. So I finally made it on, you guys. <laughs> Y'all just got to love technology. But anyhow, I'm going to allow you guys a few more moments to hop in. And we are going to get started. Tips for dry skin. Um, I use Pond. Let me go get it for you. I'll I'll show you. Hold on. Hold on. She was doing ice. She just like how, how many ice can you like? Oh. All right. You said um. You said you said tips for dry skin. This is what I use, Jenny. This is what I use. Hold on. This is what I use. Puns. And it's actually for dry to very dry skin. This is this is what I use, especially in the winter months. Um, it's kind of old school, but that is what I use. But we're going to get started here shortly, a few moments here. <laughs> that's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. 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 All right, you guys, I'm trying to wait for a few more people to hop on. Uh, fresh. Um, I'm finna get into the body washes, Jenny. I got some that's a fresh scent. Yeah, I'm finna get in. I'm trying to let a few more people come in. Um, yeah, but today's topic is all about my top favorite body washes, body care, perfume, things that I've been loving um, lately. So if you are new here, I am Latursa. Welcome. Um, sometimes I go live so I can chat with you guys because y'all know I love, love, love talking to you guys in live time. Um, this video has been long overdue. <laughs> it's been long overdue. So like I said, I wanted to pop on. I like chatting with you guys and answering you guys' questions. Y'all don't know. That makes me feel, it makes me feel like a kid in a candy store to be able to share some of my wisdom with you guys. So 
I'm gonna go ahead and get started. I know it's a Friday. Yeah, I'm gonna show you all of my products, Jenny. I'm gonna show you all of them. So, especially all of my body washes that I recommend. And like I said, all of these products are super, super affordable, you guys. Y'all know I'm all about helping you to save your coins because, I mean, it's a lot going on in the world today and we're not even gonna mention the COVID, but it, you just gotta know how to maneuver and get things how your budget fits and allows you to. So the first thing I'm gonna do is show you some of my favorite body washes that I've been loving. This one is a new one because y'all know I always forget to leave my empties, but I just got this one about a month ago. The other one just ran out, but this is Jason, the apricot. I like the one with rose water too, but I really been gravitating, I guess because it's summer, I've been loving the apricot, but it smells really, really good. It makes your skin soft and it is no paraben, sulfate, or phytolites, and it brightens and nourishes with apricot oil and white tea and vitamin E. So it makes your skin super, super soft. So if you guys want to screenshot this, you can. This is one of my all-time favorites. I've been using Jason's body wash for about two years now. And they, especially this one and the rose water one, this one I really like, especially during the summer months. Because rose water, a lot of times it's hard to find, but you can find this like in your local um, TJ Maxx, Ross. Um, you can find it in Walgreens sometimes. You can find it in Target. I think they got it now in Target, Walmart. But this one is one of my favorites. And because it's apricot, it, it kind of reminds me of summertime a lot. But they do have one that's rose water. I like that one too. But like I said, it's hard for me to find it because every time I go in the store, it's always out. So this is one of the ones that I gravitate towards. Um, I had bought my mom one and she took one home back with her, but I love these. I always, this is my backup one that I keep in the bathroom. So if you want to screenshot this, this is a really great one. And I want to say it's about six bucks in TJ Maxx. Yep. I got this at TJ Maxx, you guys, $6.99. And like I said, a little bit goes a long way. I'm the type of person... I like to see my soaps lather. If I can't see my body wash lather, I don't really like it because I just like, I like the bubbles. So if it lathers real good and it doesn't, it doesn't strip my skin because a lot of times some body washes, um, like the one, um, the, um, Dr. Bronner's, it's a good soap. It'll get you squeaky clean, but it stripped my skin too much. And I, I'm very, my skin is real sensitive. It do some crazy stuff, but I can't use Dr. Bruna. I said I was going to try the baby one because if it's good enough for a baby, it may work. I have to get a lot of stuff that's either sensitive or um, I have to get a lot of stuff that's for, um, yeah, sensitive skin because my skin, it can't take a lot of harsh stuff. So Dr. Brana is one that I, I can't use. I hope I will find it where I live because Americans have a lot of products. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's right. You did say you live. Yeah, it's, it's see if they got this one. See if they got this one in France. And then they may have some of the other ones that I'm going to show, but you can always screenshot this and then see if they have it. So the Dr. Bronner's baby scent is strong too. Cause see, I was using the the um the one that was who it was the I don't know what what color I think it was the one in the green bottle, and I used to use it years ago. But my skin started cracking. It started cracking, and it was like making me itch because it gets you squeaky clean, but it scrips your skin. So I couldn't use it. A lot of people rave about it. Um. Okay, just has the baby scent and not... Okay, but yeah, a lot of people rave about it, but me personally, I can't use it. Yeah, it, it was the almond one. I can't use it. It's too hard for me. My skin is too sensitive. I guess my skin is just like, look, don't put that hard stuff on me because it didn't like it. It didn't like it at all. Um, I haven't tried any of... I got a little small thing of the peppermint one, but I was so scared to use it. It's still brand new in my... Uh, in my um Under my cabinet because... I, I, I don't like the way it makes my skin. And then, too, with it being coming in the winter months, my skin already get really, really dry because usually it's oily. Like you can see now, it's oily to combination. But in the winter times, my skin gets really dry and, 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 and it's real 
Oh, it just, it just start be it makes me itch a lot because my skin be so dry. So this is what I was saying. The puns is for my face because my face gets really dry around here, up in here. It breaks out like really dry. You can just scratch the skin. So I have to double up with puns in my other moisturizer in the winter months coming up to the fall months. But yeah, this is a good one. Now, see, now, Dr. Bronner's may work up under my armpit because, you know, you got to do some scrubbing. But as far as my other body, it didn't like it. So I'm I, I'm not going to recommend it because if, if it's breaking me out, I don't want you guys to use it. And then it breaks you guys out, too. You know, so and then another one, y'all know, I always been raving about this one. This one is one of my favorites. And y'all can see if y'all watched my video on yesterday when I was talking about my shower routine, it's right here. And this was the second one because I had bought my mom another one when she was here and she loves it too. It's really soft and it's really moisturizing. When you use this, it makes you smell good and it leaves your skin soft. So even if you just put on regular lotion, no scent, you'll have a little scent with just using the body wash by itself. This one is a really good one. And like I said, it's really inexpensive. This is like five bucks at Walmart. And they even have it in Burlington because the other day when I was in Burlington, they had it there as well. So you can screenshot this one. This one is another one that I love. Um, like I said, it's almost out. It's about right here. I wish I can tear it so you guys can see because I, I use my products over here, you guys. <laughs> when I buy stuff, you best to believe I, I be using it. <laughs> and I use a lot too. That's why I said I use my products, you guys. I don't just be buying stuff. Well, the way my bank account set up, I can't just be buying stuff. But um, yeah, there it is. It's right there. Yep. It's, it's almost out. But this one, you guys, screenshot this. This is one of my all-time favorites. And I mix it with a lot of my um, other body washes, too. But this one, really, really, it's one of my favorites. So, got that one. And then, y'all know I always rave about soft soap. This scent, I didn't like it. I'm going to have to stick with my um, oatmeal and honey or almond and honey. That's my favorite one from soft soap. This one, I tried it because it had um, amber and honey. Y'all know I love anything that has honey on it. But the little bit that I got left, I'm probably going to use it to clean my bathtub because it's not one of my favorites. But the soft soap with the honey and almond in it, it's kind of light brown. That's my favorite. But soft soap makes some good some good body washes you guys so if you like amber you will love this one but this was one of my ones i didn't really care for but because i paid my money for it i was using it and i'm gonna use this last little bit to clean my tub out with it because i don't like the way it smells it's soft but i don't like the way it smells but the one that's honey and i want to say it's honey and almond it, it has honey in it too and it's the light brown one but this this brand, Soft Soap, is one of my absolute favorite ones. So, yeah, if you go to Walmart, they have it in Walmart. They have different different scents or whatever. Find one that you like because Soft Soaps make some really good um, uh, body wash. And I even use the Soft Soap, the almond one. I use that for my bubble bath as well. And I also use this one as a bubble bath too. So you can't go wrong with, with those, those um, body washes there. And then y'all know my holy grail, <laughs> uh, Irish Spring. I'm going to talk about Irish Spring until God takes me home. Because this, I don't use it all over my body. I just use it for my backside. It gets me squeaky clean. It keeps me clean. I don't have to worry about no little foul, little odor. And I forgot to bring my little pouch that I leave in the car, but I have a travel size one. You can get a travel size Irish Spring one in Walmart. Yes, you can get a travel size one in Walmart. So if you got a Walmart, Jenny, in France, then... I know they should have Irish Spring because this, you can use, yeah, you can use this all over your body, not on your lady parts. You can use this all over your body because I grew up on Irish Spring. You know, I'm old school. I grew up on Irish Spring uh, body wash and Irish Spring soap. You can't go wrong with Irish Spring, but don't use this on your downstairs area because this is not it. This is, you don't want to do that. But this will get your backside really clean. When you get in the shower, and while you're washing your other body parts, 
get you a rag or whatever you use to clean your behind with and put some of this and let it be soaking while you clean the rest of your body. I promise you, you won't have backside odor at all. I'm telling you, you, you don't know. I'm going to see if I can. Oh, wow. I can't believe they don't sell it on Amazon because Amazon got everything. Yeah, but this is, this is really, really, this is my holy grail. I've been talking about this since I've been on YouTube. Um, about shower routines and stuff I use in my shower. This is my, and I got two more backups in the bathroom because this one is about right here. You can't see it, but it's down to right here because like I said, I only use this for my backside. I don't use this anywhere else. I just use it to clean my behind with. This right here will get you so, 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 so clean. You don't have to worry about an uh, odor or anything if you're using Irish Spring. So that's that one. And then um, when I have the um, coconut lime tree hut sugar strub, I like to pair it with this right here, the, the body wash. You can find these at uh, TJ Maxx. You can find them at Walmart. Wherever they sell tea, uh, tree hut um, products, you can find it. And this one was $3 because it was on clearance. But I like to use this in conjunction with my um, tree hut coconut lime um scrubs and it just something about when you layer the two together it really does smell and it lathers really good you guys and like i said this is inexpensive all of these products are are like between six and below they're nothing i don't have anything over here that's over six dollars so you could bet your dollar i'm gonna be uh telling you we have tree her here i yeah yeah so yeah look for this one the coconut lime one and look for the scrub to go with it and they have the body butter too so when you layer those three together you will smell good yeah yeah so try this try this scent i like this one i like the mango scent too the mango one too but i i, I always couldn't find the body wash i would find like the scrub but then i couldn't find the body wash so it was always like i would find one um find one without the other but like i said um i have the limiting cup okay okay yeah the lip the lime one yeah so look for the body wash in the body butter i'm telling you if you layer those together and y'all know i always use bath uh i ain't like the moroccan rose it didn't smell right to me but you know everybody's scent is different everybody tastes is different but i ain't like the moroccan rose that's one they could have kept it's one that i really want to try um they have just came out now the mango one yep i like that one i love that one you don't like it <laughs> i love mango i see i love fruity stuff <laughs> i'm a fruity girl i love fruity stuff yeah the mango one was really that's one of my favorites i like the tropical mango one. Oh, okay 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 but yeah look for this one when you go and they got some they got some new scents out now too i haven't tried them yet but it's on my to-do list. Like I said, I like to use my products up first and then go and get some. Because, like I said, the way my bank account set up, I can't just be buying a whole bunch of stuff. Now, if I see it on sale, now no, I'm not going to lie to you. If I see it on sale, I'll go ahead and pick it up. Especially if it's something that I like. Because a lot of times, when you go to stores like TJ Maxx and stuff, you can find them for cheaper than they are even at Walmart. So, you have to look at that too. So, um, that's another a really good one. And then y'all know you can't go wrong with Suave. And my favorite scent in the Suave is the honey and the honey and shea butter one. It's kind of yellow like, but they were out of it. I got this at Big Lots, but it's the tropical coconut and it smells, it smells good too. You pair this with this, you pair these two, they smell tropical and then you top it off um, this is the perfume that I pair with the Floriano Coconut. It's by Dossier. It's the dupe for Tom Ford Soleil Blanc. Tom Ford Soleil Blanc cost two something or a hundred and something. Whatever price it was, this cost $39. And y'all can see I've already put a dent in it and I haven't had it no more than two weeks. But when you take a shower with these two, Coconut Tropical and this Coconut uh, Milk and Vitamin E, and spray yourself with this. It's called layering. It smells heavily. I've been wearing this so much. I just be thinking I'm on the beach somewhere. 
But like I said, this is in the notes and this one is cardamom, pistachios, bergamot. The middle notes is ylang-ylang, tuberose, jasmine, and the base notes is amber, cedarwood, coconut, and benzoyl. So yeah, here it is. You can get it from Darcier. It's this, this, this right here. They're online and, and they do like dupes for designer perfumes like Gucci, Tom Ford, um, Libre, uh, YSL Libre. But I'm telling you, this coconut, uh, oriental coconut, it's really good. You could take a screenshot of it. But I'm, I'm telling you, it is something fierce. And I take that. And like I said, when I take a shower with these two and layer with this, girl, you be smelling like you finna go on the beach like a whole coconut smoothie or something. <laughs> I mean, this is really good. And it's 1.7 fluid ounces for 40 bucks compared to the real Tom Ford Soleil Blanc. It's like a hundred and something. And even the travel size is like 30 bucks. But you can pay $39 and get... And then the little top, I just like it like this. Uh-oh. But the little top is magnetic, y'all. Look at that. I thought that was so cute. Y'all know I'm a sucker for cute stuff. But look at that. So you can lose, you can drop this off in your bag too if you need to, but I'm telling you, you can't go wrong with Suave. And this is only two bucks, you guys. I'm telling you, when I want to take a bubble bath, I put this in there because Suave makes some good products and they're always, they always have moisturizing body wash. But my favorite of this one, and because I just bought this one, I'm going to use it, and I didn't get the my honey and um, shea butter one, but this is really good, you guys. So I'm telling you, you cannot go wrong with this right here. Mix these two together. This is $5 at Walmart. This is $2. It's $1.88 at Walmart. This was $2 at Big Lots, but for six, seven bucks, here you go, right here. Use this in your shower and pair it with this right here girl you be walking out the house and people be like what's that you got on and you know i be like you know I, you can't be smelling like me now boo I, it's a secret but you know i still probably tell them because i mean i want people to save their money why you gonna why would i pay more when i'm gonna get the same smell and the same luxury feel for a cheaper price that's just how i look at it now will i go get the the real one eventually i probably will well i took my original one back i bought the tom ford soleil blanc because i've been wanting it since last year but when i saw this i hurry up and found my receipt and took it back and got my money back and i, I ordered this <laughs> oh my god y'all i'm telling you guys i'm all about saving your coins honey i i that's that's just what i really believe in and then the next one that I'm going to talk about is Dial. Y'all know I always talk about Dial. You can't go wrong with Dial. This is one, and I'm going to tell you a story behind this. <laughs> this right here, right before this video, I just opened this top. Because at first, I was mad at it. Because I couldn't open it. So I would have to do this in the shower. I would have to do this and pull it in my hand or on my loofah. And today, of all places, the thing opened. I'm like, really? And I've been had this for two months, y'all. And I've been, I like it, but I hate it because I couldn't get the top to work. But it smells just like coconut. And when you was talking about a fresh scent, this is one that smells really fresh. Coconut water by Dial. It smells really fresh. It doesn't really have a, a scent to it. It's just a fresh scent. Yeah, it's just a fresh scent. And like I said, a little bit goes a long way. Y'all know I told you I'm a sucker for stuff. If it doesn't suck good, <laughs> you're a mess. You're a mess, Shadiqua. But if it doesn't lather good, I don't be wanting it. But this is a fresh, clean scent. And I want to say this, you get this out of Walmart. But I was just saying, um... I was mad at this one because I couldn't open it. And then today, right before the video, I opened it. And then, see, I was using it, but I couldn't, I didn't like it because I would have to take this off. I would have to take it off like this. But then today, today, it's going to open up. Really, boo? But like I said, this one is a fresh scent, a uh, uh, fresh scent, and it's coconut water. It's supposed to be the hydrating body wash, but this one, I really like it. Like I said, sometimes when I take a bath, I also put this in my bath. I'm real 
when I do my baths, I'm real good about whatever body wash I'm using. If it's something that's fresh, not heavily scented, but like these two, I put these in my bath water when I do take a bath. But what you missed, Shaniqua, is I was telling her about the combination, these two. And this one was $2, and this one is $5 at Walmart. Everything that I'm discussing today is all under $6, because y'all know I believe in saving my coins. <laughs> I believe in saving my coins. But these two is tropical. And I was telling about Dossier Air. I paired with the dupe, uh, Oriano Floriano Coconut, which is a dupe for Tom Ford Soleil Blanc. When I mix these two together and take a shower and then I spray this, oh girl, this right here is $39 on Dossier. The real Tom Floyd Soleil Blanc is like a hundred and something dollars. Depending on what, how big a size it is, it goes up to like $200. How about your girl got her receipt and took Tom Ford Soleil Blanc back to Sephora and went purchase this. Hey, I went purchase this because this 40 bucks compared to a hundred something dollars. So I was like, look, if I'm going to smell good for cheap, and it's lasting, y'all. It lasts the same way the real Tom Ford the Blanc do. Soleil Blanc. But that was almost 100 and something, and this was 40 bucks. So you do the math. You, you save you some coins and get you this, and you still go smell heavenly, because every time I go out with this, I have, I have men coming up to me, and it make me nervous, because I be like, y'all ain't going to try to take nothing, because I smell so sweet in you, you know. <laughs> I'd be like, woo! But that's what happens when you go out smelling really, really good and, and your scent be lingering. Because a lot of times you can't really smell it as strong as somebody else can. But this right here, I've had this for, I think, maybe two weeks. And this is, I put a dent in it already. Because this is a 1.7 fluid ounce, you guys. If you could get the same designer feeling scent for cheap, I highly recommend. I'm, I'm just saying, Shanika, I be getting scared. I be getting scared. You know, I told God, I said, I'm ready, but you taking me a little too fast. <laughs> that, that dating scene is crazy in these streets. But uh, when you get my age, you know, I ain't in college no more. But yeah, when you put this on and then you put these two together, oh, you're going to be smelling like a whole coconut smoothie. You're going to be smelling good. You know, just get ready. Just get ready. You're going to be smelling really good. And thing is, you ain't used number $6. This is $4.98 and this is $2. Well, $7. Because well, it's $1.88 at Walmart. And I'm telling you, this right here will get you right. Mix these two together in the shower. And y'all comment on Instagram and let me know how you do it. You can get these from Walmart, you guys. It's no reason for y'all to be going broke in these streets trying to smell good. You can if that's what you if that's what you choose but the way my bank account is set up i have to do stuff in increments you know it has to be treat terse a day or spoiling terse a day uh after the bills paid then i can go in and do all that you know but for the time being i still won't smell good but just on an affordable budget does that make sense to you guys so these two It'll get you right. It'll get you right. It'll get you right. It'll get you right. And I'm telling you, this right here, y'all go to Dossier. I think I said that right. And I'm telling you, look for your favorite designer scents. Look for your favorite ones. And go get it and see if you can get a sample from Sephora and see if they smell not identical or just the same. This smells just like Tom Ford Soleil Blanc, y'all. Y'all know I wouldn't lie to y'all. I'll tell you if it's thinking. Because I had got one from Dossier. And it was a dupe for Lancome, I think. And it said, the reason why I got it, because it said something like it was tropical. And, you know, I like fruity scents. But, hun, I had to send that one on back. Because it ain't really, it ain't really do, do right for your girl. It had my nose burning. So, I had to send that one back. But I'm going to tell you what I did do, though. I, I got my replacement. And see, this had come. This is why I say it be cute. It's the little stuff for me. It's the details for me, y'all. So it came like this. And it comes with a little note card so you can see it. But this is the dupe, you guys, for um, this. If I can get it out now. This is the dupe for Perfect. Mark Jacobs Perfect. When I tell y'all this smells just like Perfect. 
is floral rhubarb. I think that's how you say it. Hey, Samantha. And this is $29 compared to perfect was $92. When I saw that, I said, well, I won't have to go to Sephora and get that. I'm going to go on over to Dossier. That's $29. And when I tell y'all, this smell good. I wore this when I went to bed and I just sniffed myself. You know how you sniff yourself because you don't want nothing surprising to come up on you. But I, this right here smells just like Marc Jacobs Perfect. And it smells good. And the thing is, you get 1.7 fluid ounces. And then the little top, look at that. I thought that was so cute. You know, I, you know, if it's cute, I like it, you know. But, oh, shit. Oh, oh Sarah. You're wrong. Excuse me. Excuse me. Uh-oh. Excuse me. Okay. See, that's what happens when you have kids. No, this is, is what happens when you know my when you basically have my sister. Really? Sarah, Sarah hey, look, look, y'all. I'm not crazy. Sarah done, <laughs> done crawled up on the table and grabbed my leg. You know, I ain't I ain't built for that. I'm not built for that. Excuse me. Excuse me, y'all. Excuse me. I ain't mean that. I ain't mean that that came out. Funny comments. Is, is, wait a minute. Is y'all gonna let me do this video? I mean, I've been basically said you said 30 minutes. Okay, listen, listen. Hey, audience, can you all tell me how long it's Wait been? Wait a minute. Listen, uh, excuse me. Can I do my video, please? 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 Okay. I forgot what I was saying, y'all. Uh oh. Excuse me. I forgot what I was saying. 31 minutes and about 32 it's, minutes. Ishmael. About. Can y'all let me, I'm about a few more minutes. Please, please, <laughs> please, few more minutes. Please, okay. What was I saying, y'all? I forget. You wrong. You was talking about your perfume. Okay, okay, yeah. Okay, whew. Oh, Lord, that's good. Okay, listen, but what I was saying is this is the dude for... It's okay, yeah, yeah. This was the dupe for Mark Jacobs Perfect. Y'all go to Sephora this weekend and smell it and see if you like it. If you like it, don't pay $92. Don't do that. I mean, you can. You can if you want to because that's your money and that's how your bank account is set up. But if you want to save you some coins, go to Dossier and I think they have it. The more bottles you get, you get up to like 20, 30% off and they probably got to sell because it's Labor Day weekend and no, this is not sponsored. I wish they would sponsor you, girl, because send me some perfume. But listen, this right here is the dupe. It smells so good, y'all. I would spray it on me, but this ain't what I wore today. I wore, I wore this one today. Soleil Blanc, uh, well, the dupe. I wore this one today. and But this one right here, it smells so good. I was like, okay, Darcy, I see you. I see you. I see you, boo. But yeah, this this is what I be saying, y'all. I be wanting y'all to spend. I will. I be wanting y'all to smell good, but I be wanting y'all to spend your money wisely. Not that I can tell you how to spend your money, but if I can help you save some coins, then you know that's what you that's what your girl gonna do. That's what I'm gonna do. And then um, I think for y'all that just came on, I always rave about this one. Y'all should know this one by now. Y'all should know this one. This is what I use. I only use this to clean my behind. That's all I use it for. Now, I'm going to tell you a story. Now, I am old school. You know, I'm a 70s baby. So, we grew up in my household. This is what we use, Irish Spring. And back then, because I didn't know no better, I was using it everywhere, including downstairs. But I know better now. So, I use this for downstairs. But this right here, while you washing the rest of your body, this right here would keep you clean. Have this soaking in your behind while you clean the rest of your areas on your body. And then when you get through, wash your sip. Okay. It smells like, it just smell to me, it just make you smell like you clean. I don't know what it smell like. I just know it just make you smell fresh. Uh-uh, Sarah, you didn't did enough today. I was, I was going to smell. Uh, okay, go, tell, tell the people how you, what you think it smell like. Come on, since you're going to scare me up on the doggone table. How you think it smell? Hold on a sec. I gotta smell it again. You see what I be working with over here? I'm trying to do my job, minding my business. Mm. <laughs> Any day now, Sarah. 
Sorry, you know I'm kind of nose blind. Oh, good, give me this. <laughs> Put it down, sit down. But yeah, it just it just got like a clean, like you know you squeaky clean. This I this I smelled me. It's just a fresh scent, but it's strong and it's strong enough to keep that odor away. Yeah, I'm telling you, I grew up in my household. You either had Dial or you had Irish Spring. You choose that gold bar Dial. That's what I grew up on. You either had that or Irish Spring bar soap. That's what that's what I grew up on, and I've always been using it. But since I've been older, I use the body wash to clean my backside area. And you can't never go wrong with Dial, y'all. Dial is an antibacterial soap. A lot of people don't like, you know, bar soap, but I'm old school, y'all. I use, I use bar soap. Yeah, see, that Dow gonna get you clean if you just using Dow and you don't. She old what? school. <laughs> if you just use Dow, you gonna get clean. If you don't use none of these products I'm talking about, if you use Dow, you gonna get clean. Cause Dow is just one of them soaps, and you can get them. Two for a dollar at the Dollar Tree. You can get them two for a dollar and something at Walmart. If that's all you got in your house is down, you still going to be clean. You ain't even got to worry about none of this other stuff that I've been talking about. But if you're using Dow and you're using Irish Spring, you're you going to be clean. Because the thing of it is, how you get rid of body odor is you got to make sure your base is clean. That's what I think a lot of us miss, including myself in my younger days. I've been there hitting and missing. And I be missing the important parts. You know, the little whole bath. If y'all missed that video, <laughs> my grandmother used to call it the whole bath. It, it's just when you take a bath, you take, you hit the main key areas, underarms, your private part, your behind, your foot. You know, you're hitting the main areas that hold the odor. That's what, I, that's what I call the whole bath. But I talked about that. If you only got one thing, this or the dial, you still going to get clean. And I use rags. I used to use the exfoliating gloves, but because this right side, my hand is still funny, I can't put my hand up in the glove, you know, right. So I use the exfoliating washcloth or the little, you can get them from the Dollar Tree for a dollar. And I take that and use that and lather all up, you know, when I don't use my loofah. But the next product that I had talked about before y'all came was the Tree Hut, the coconut lime one. This is one of my holy grails and i use it in conjunction with the body scrub the same fragrance coconut lime and when you layer them two together because it's coconut you use the tom ford soleil blanc dupe be smelling like a whole smoothie Yours yeah smell yeah like it smell mm -mm. gone over there boo but yeah when you um when you late for work that whole bath works really good yeah you like wash your face, wash them key area, and go on out the door. That's that's it, Samantha. Whole bath is gonna get you right. And then um, this one, I always been using Saint Ives, but I used to use the coconut one, the the oats and honey one. I think it's brown, but I love Saint Ives products because it's paraben free. That that's why I like, and they moisturize. Them. And if you miss my hygiene haul from Big Lots. I got this one for three dollars at Saint at, at Big Lots, so don't sleep on Big Lots, you guys. But apricot and mix this together, and I'm gonna talk about this one in the next in a few minutes. But I mix all three of these together. If you do this in the morning and you don't, you having a hard time getting out the bed, this will wake you up. I'm telling you, put these three together, and they will wake you up for real. Saint Ives, it smells straight. If you like peachy scents, like apricot and stuff like that, because see, I talked about this one. This is my other favorite one, apricot, the Jason. I like the rose water too, but it's hard to find that one. So Jason is my backup, but I love it because it smells like apricot and it leaves your skin feeling really soft. And you can get this for seven bucks, six ninety nine at TJ Maxx. This is my backup one because my other one ran out. But this right here, yeah, girl, St. Ives have all kind of body washes. Girl, you 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 better be, you'll be in Walgreens or Target. They got them in Target. They got a strawberry scent. They got the, I always get the oatmeal one because, you know, oatmeal is good for if you have itchy, itchy skin. So it's really good for that. But yeah, St. Ives apricot, this was like three bucks. And it's probably even cheaper in Walmart. So yeah, this right here, use this in the mornings, you guys. It will pick you up, wake you up. If you're having a hard time, you know how them days when some days you wake up on the wrong side of the bed 
And you be like, Lord, not today. Do I got to go in and work today? Can I just call in? Can I just call in sick today? This is what you use to wake you up. Because I'm telling you, it's just one of them scents. It ain't too strong. It ain't too loud. It's just right. And it smells just like apricot. So if you want to be smelling like a whole coconut smoothie, pair it with this. These three. I'm trying, I'm trying to show y'all. Because everything I got up here is like coconut, apricot, something like this. You can even add the suave. Y'all know this is $1.88 at Walmart. I like the honey one at Walmart, but I had already bought the tropical coconut one from Big Lot, so I didn't get it. But pair all your coconut scents together and use your dupe, Tom Ford Soleil Blanc, I'm telling you. Y'all be y'all be getting in trouble tonight. I'm tell I'm telling you what God love. Y'all know I ain't gonna come on here and lie to y'all. If if y'all if y'all gonna get in if y'all wanna get in trouble, use this concoction. Use this concoction. I'm telling you, you be in, you be walking out the house and people be coming. And you be you be just attracting folks to you. They be like, what you got on? Suave. You can't go wrong with suave, honey. Suave is one of my old time favorites. I used to use it in college. You know, when you're a broke college student, you know, suave, a dollar eighty eight. you can't go wrong with that. That's why I was saying, like, dial and stuff, them old school, you can't go wrong with it. It's going to get you clean. Because in my house, my mom always used to say, if you ain't using dial and you ain't using iron spring, you just going to be musty. You know, back in them days, you, you didn't really have a choice. <laughs> you just use what they had in the house or else you just going to be musty. You, you, you know, them old school mamas. My mom was old school. And uh, if you didn't use dial or you didn't use Irish Spring, unless you had a little job and you made your own money, then you buy something what you want. But if they buying it, that's what you was using. Holy Grail. Dial and, and Irish Spring. And they even got Irish Spring in the Dollar Tree now for a dollar. Little bar soaps. And even in the travel size in Walmart, they got the... Um, they got the travel size a body gel for Irish Spring now. And that's that's what I always tell you guys to keep in your little pouch in your purse. You know, extra care, an extra care pair of clean panties, you know, some soap, deodorant, little tampons, pads, panty liners, you know, stuff where you can freshen up throughout the day. And then I talked about soft soap. Y'all know I always talk about soft soap. This was a scent that I didn't like. So it's almost gone, but I'm gonna use the rest of it to uh clean my tub with it yes yes they do yes they do girl i love walgreens i like going in there and stack up my points so i can so i can get some free stuff but they always have deals sometimes they have like this week i think they had um dub buy one and get one 50 off or something like that in walgreens y'all know i always be trying to keep y'all posted on them deals and then they they sometimes be having these soft soaps two for eight dollars and then sometimes they have irish spring and walgreens two for eight dollars so when they do that i i stack up on i stock up on especially stuff i know that i'm gonna use all the time but this one is amber and honey i ain't like it it's almost gone. You know, I use my products because I don't, I don't waste it, but I'm going to wash the tub with this because I ain't, I ain't like the way that smelled on me. It just it just went in for me. I didn't like it. So this, I'm not going to throw it away. <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and, and wash my tub out with it. You know, I'm going to make good use of it, but putting it on my body, I'm going to stick with what I love. That's the honey. I can't think of the name of it. It's the brown one. It's the honey one like this in the soft soap. And then they got like a raspberry, blueberry one. I like that one too. The peony one, didn't like that one either. So it's just, I'm kind of picky. When I find stuff that I really like, I kind of just keep getting it because I'm a creature of habit. Uh, my favorite bar soap is for downstairs area is Dove Sensitive. It always keeps me right. Anytime, I only use feminine wash when it's that time of the month. Just because I want an extra little security. But I try to make it a habit. I don't use feminine wash every day. I only use it that time of the month. But this is the soap that I use for my downstairs area. Now, for my body, I use uh, Dial, the white bar, antibacterial. Uh, let, I'm going to go get a pick. I'm going to go get one for you and show you. Show you. Hold on. Hey folks, how you all doing? It seems like I'm gonna need to be here while my mother's go grabbing some stuff. 
I like pop, pomegranate, and mango. Mm. So, that's nice. Oh, no, she's coming back. <laughs> All right, I'm back, you guys. So I went grab my soaps, but this is the travel size dial that I was talking about. It's in the travel section in Walmart. Uh, that, but my bar soaps. This is the antibacterial soap that I was talking about. That's what I use to clean my body first before I do any body wash. And this is a dollar and something for two at Walmart, or you can get it two for a dollar at the Dollar Tree. But this is my dial that I wash my body, and because I was in that tropical mood. I was using Dove, the mango one. And I like Dove soaps, but to me, they just for smelling good and keeping your skin soft. I don't really think it gets me clean, clean. That's why I always fall back to my Holy Grail dial because you can't go wrong because this is the antibacterial soap. So if you want to screenshot that, that's what I use. But if you want something that smells really good after you done cleaned your body good with this, I like Dove. Yeah, it does. I, I always go back to Dove and then this, like I said, this is the body wash. This this the coconut water body wash dial. And I couldn't get it open. So that's why it's not gone because I hated opening this in the shower instead of just using the pump. But today of all times, I got it open. That's, that's crazy. But I got it open. So, and then for my son, I get him this. Zest Pure Cleansing Bar. Or he used dial just like me and my baby so zest for if you got a son if you got husbands zest is it really good i get this for my son but as far as a whole household we use dial faithfully this is our holy grail this and this right here you can't go wrong because the thing of it is you want to get your base clean before you start putting on all your smell goods because if your arm yeah, because if your arms ain't clean, if your body base is not clean, you can put all the smell goods you want on there, but it, it's just going to mask the funk. It's not going to get rid of it. So if I was you, I would take the time to clean my body good. And antibacteria, it gets rid of the germs. So, you know, a lot of people don't like bar soaps no more, but, you know, I'm old school, you know. It is what it is, but this has always been my holy grail even when i was in college when i was younger it was this in irish spring that's what my household grew up on and to this day my mom and dad still use dial the orange bar they still use it they don't use no other soap but dial when you go in my parents bathroom that's what you gonna smell some dial the gold bar or this right here that's what you gonna smell i know my parents i grew up with them so this right here will get you clean now if you want something to just moisturize and smell good this dove you can't go wrong with dove products dove make good products but for me dove to me i don't it don't seem like it gets me clean you know so i have to go in with something stronger and i do i, I wash my body at least three to a good two to three times with the wash rag before i go in with all my little sprays and all that stuff and like i said dove sensitive if y'all missed the video on my hygiene routine um, go back and watch that but I was talking about this one because I was out so I went to the Walmart and I got two bars today because this works really well for my downstairs area anytime I try to do something else and try to go with something else that it don't work right see that's my thing when I be trying to try something different I either break out or it makes me itch or it don't make me feel good so i have to stick with what works so yeah where i may change up my body washes and stuff because i love to smell different stuff but as far as my base you're gonna always find these two in my sink under my cabinet in my 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 little cart you're gonna always find these two and and this if i don't have anything else in my house i'm gonna have this and this and like I said, all these products, they less than seven bucks. You can't, you can't go wrong. Like I said, you could take you $10. Yeah, you can't, you can't be, you can't be just putting stuff, you know, in your private areas and thinking it's just going to say, Hey, 
I like what you did. See, mine's be getting the attitude. And she gets ugly. And when she act ugly, I don't feel good. So I stick to my 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 holy grails, what works, because trying all that different stuff, down there just ain't gonna work. But anyway, that's that. But going back to this one, this right here, they had a lemon one too. But this one was my favorite, the grapefruit peel. And I've only seen these at Big Lots. I don't even know if they have them anywhere else. If they got them anywhere else, they was out of this scent. But this right here, oh, when I tell y'all, it smells. Smell like grapefruit. And y'all know I'm a fruity girl. I like stuff to smell sweet, cute. You know, I like sweet smells. I'm a fruity girl. I like all my stuff. I, I like fruity girl. And then y'all know my all-time favorite perfume. I done put a dent in it my way. I love this. And I even have the travel size to go in my purse. And, and as you can see, I done put a dent in that too. But I be trying not to grab this because y'all, when I get out of this, I get sad. I get, I be want to cry. I be, I do. I do. I, I be want to cry. So I be trying to hide this from myself so I won't pick it up as much. Because this is my, this right here is what, this will probably be my signature scent. Because I, I be want to wear it every day. But I can't do that because this is just for that, you know, special occasions. But I promise you, I go through this so quick. I've been trying to hide it from myself so I won't have to mess with it. But if you like fruity smells, I don't know what the note is. Y'all know I ain't good with that. This is by Georgie. Giorgio or money or money. This is like my holy my one of my all-time favorites Y'all know I switch up in my perfumes, but this I always seem to go back to this one and thank you next by Ariana Grande They they are like my top favorites and then this was a new scent that I found in Sephora the Dolce Cabana light blue forever now the Dolce Cabana the Dolce Cabana, Gabbana, the original, it stinks to me. I don't like it. But this forever, oh, honey, forever have you, girl, happy. Oh, girl, this just, you see how I done put a dent in it? Because y'all know I always say on this channel, when you want to try something new, go get the travel size, the travel sprays. Get this, and this was, I would say this was 30 bucks. Yeah, 30 bucks. But I love it. So eventually, I'm going to get the big bottle. But I like this. It's the Dolce Cabana Light Blue Forever. And when I tell y'all, it smells so good. When I put this on, it just it just takes me to a place where I just be happy. Y'all know how when you smell good, it, the... No, you ain't the only one, because when I smell, because when they be hyping it up on, on YouTube, I be like, I don't get it. If my nose stopped up, because when I smelled it, it was stinking. You know, it's just me. It could be just me, but I ain't like it. And so I wasn't finna get it just to come on YouTube and tell y'all, go get this. No, I ain't finna tell you to do that, because I can't recommend stuff that I don't like. Now, I know everybody got different tastes and all that good stuff, but listen, I ain't like that original. I ain't like that original at all. But when I saw this, I told you because I lean towards more towards the fruity fragrances. That's that's my thing. But this right here, oh, <clears throat> it'll get you right. This, I'm telling you, try the travel size, you guys, before you, yeah, <laughs> yeah, YouTube, boys, people will have you spending millions of dollars on YouTube. That's why I say I have to stay within <clears throat> In my budget, I give myself a budget every month to spend on perfumes. I can only do one a month. And I ain't ashamed to say that. I ain't ashamed to say that. At the most, two. And I, I'm a firm believer. I'm a firm believer in them four payments. Them four payments. Y'all know the corner, the four payments? Oh, girl, they, they, they like my best friend. I ain't ashamed. Well, ashamed for what? Listen, when you're trying to save your coins... Sometimes all you can do is chop it up in four pavements. But I allow myself at least two fragrances. That's about all I can do. I can't do all that extra stuff. And it's got to be something that I know I'm going to wear. I don't be buying stuff just so it can look cute in a perfume tray. It's cute and stuff. Now, if you want to gift me one, that's fine. But I'm saying if I'm going out and spend my money, I ain't finna get it because it look cute on a tray. And the bottle's cute. That's cute too. But I got to be able to smell it and love it 
for it to come home with me. I'm not getting it because it's, it, it, it's, it's going to be cute on the tray. Because my pocketbooks is not going to be cute. Keep spending money. That's that's why I be telling y'all, you can smell good on a budget. It's just all about how you plan it. You ain't got to go out here and break the bank. Now, if that's what you choose to do, that's your bank account. I can't tell you how to spend your money. But as for me, I'm going to always try to bring you guys affordable stuff. So that's my little spiel, you guys, for today. I hope y'all got a little laughter. And again, I'm sorry that I cursed. But y'all, when somebody scared me off guard, I'm surprised that was the only word that came out. But in, 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 I'm telling you again, I'm sorry. Why would someone do it on guard? Why would someone scare you on guard? You, you, see what I, you, see, you see what I be working with? That's why I be forgetting what I'm about to say. Ma, you already forgot before I said anything. <laughs> I, I forget. I, I've been looking at Zara, but I haven't been to Zara in a while. I don't like going to... I don't like going to the big city. I'm a country girl. But the next time I go to Zara, it's two that I got my eye on. One is, it smells like vanilla, because y'all know I love vanilla scents. What do you recommend Zara perfume? Because I haven't tried any of their perfumes, but I be watching YouTube videos. Y'all know I love watching perfume and hygiene videos. You know, I just, and cleaning and organizing. They're my things I love to watch on YouTube. But somebody was talking about a scent from Zara, and it was like all mango in. And I was like, ooh, that sounds like my kind of scent kind of sauce right there but no i haven't tried any perfume from zara um it's on my to-do list but you know i'll get there when i get there maybe that'll be when i splurge for my birthday in a couple of months maybe that's when i'll um do some zara perfume or something but like i said i hope you guys enjoyed these chats do y'all like when i come on live let me know do y'all like when i come on live or y'all just like when i make regular videos because i like talking to you guys I get to know you guys and y'all see y'all can see I'm just as goofy as ever. <laughs> yeah, I like I like coming on live and I think Fridays are my best days because y'all know I go to bed with the chickens. Cause by 6 30, I ain't lying, I be looking high as a kite. But I like coming on live. But like I said, y'all send me some more topic and stuff y'all want to um new it few minutes. Oh, okay, okay. I'm going to have to check into that, Jenny. I'm going to have to check, check into that. Yeah. Thank you for the recommendations. Okay, okay, cool. That's cool. Okay, but yeah, y'all send me some more topics y'all want me to talk about because I think I, I know it's coming in the future. I'm going to do a grocery haul and like um, Sprouts, the Whole Foods stores and Trader Joe's and show y'all how I stock up on my groceries and stuff. I know that's coming. And then I got some more hygiene um, topics to come. You know, especially um, just things that I want you guys to to know, you know, to help you on your journey. Um, I think I got one coming about things every woman should know by the time they're 40. Because y'all know I'm a little bit past 40. I'm still 21 in my heart, but, you know, you know, age is it's, it's on there. So, yeah, I got some more topics coming for you guys. But just bear with me because, like I said, I like engaging with you guys because, I just like to be silly and goofy, really. But I promised my kiddos I was taking them back to Walmart. So that's why you see my son keep coming up here in the video. He clocking me. No, she said it would take 30 minutes. Shut up. Everybody shut, check the video. Shut, this is about to be an hour. See, see what I'm saying? See what I'm saying? But yeah, I promised them. I think little mommy's sleep. <laughs> I promised them I was going to take them back to Walmart. Okay, okay. Yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. 40 and some change. I'll be 43 in November. <laughs> yep. Yeah. So, yeah, it's a, it's some things I done learned in my almost 43 years on this earth. And I, I just get a kick out of sharing them with you guys because if I can help you guys, that just brightens my day. So, yeah, but you guys, give this video a thumbs up, you guys. Let, let YouTube know y'all like these types of videos because you know that algorithm stuff. It be having my head hurt. Because it's like when I put out videos and it don't do really well, it gets in my soul. But I'm like, that algorithm, boy, it's like they just want you to do one specific topic. And, and I have so much to share with you guys because it's so much I want to share with you guys. Like, you know, things that I've learned over the years. So, but yeah, y'all y'all comment in the comment sessions. Uh, not sessions. Comment sections on different topics you want me to do. 
um, in the future. Because like I said, I'll probably spend the weekend. I usually don't work on the weekends, but these topics are fresh in my mind. I want to go ahead and get them over with because that editing, I'm still learning about that editing thing. That editing thing make my head hurt. I don't mind recording the video, but the doggone editing, I ain't got that good in doing all that, tra you know, all that the extra stuff. I try to keep it as I try to keep my video simple because that editing stuff make my head hurt. But I really appreciate you guys for watching yesterday's video. I thank you for coming on here, chilling with your girl today. We're gonna try to do this again next Friday. So y'all send me some topics, DM me on Instagram. Y'all make sure y'all follow me on TikTok. Cause can y'all believe your girl is on TikTok? And my and my my daughter gonna tell me, Mama, TikTok ain't for old people. But anyway, your girl is on TikTok now. I don't post every 30 minutes now. I'm going to tell you that now. I ain't, I ain't really I ain't really got to that part yet. But y'all follow me over on Instagram and, and DM me some topics or comment below this video what kind of topics y'all want me to do. Because I only want to do things that you guys can learn something from or you guys enjoy watching. Because otherwise, why am I doing videos? Because it's you guys. It's, it's my babies on here that I want you guys to enjoy watching and i so appreciate it because it's tons yeah it's tons of people you guys watch on youtube and you chose to pick little old bitty me to be one of them so i thank you guys remember you are absolutely enough and everything you need is already on the inside of you so god bless and i'll see you on the next video